In this video, I'll teach you how to create this with your smartphone. Hi guys you are welcome to this video tutorial in today's video i will show you the step-by-step -step way to create the coca-cola product commercial video art in CapCut. so let's jump right into the video all right guys so the link to download CapCut application is in the description below so right now i will walk you through the step-by-step -step way to create this product video art just follow me and you will definitely get it all right so once you download the CapCut application just tap on this new project so once you tap on new project i'll just go to my stock video so right here, we are not adding any stock video to it. We just want to add a background, all right? So here's the background. So I want to add a white background. So I'll tap on this white background. Then I'll click on this add. So once you click on add, just wait for it to load. All right, so let's wait. All right, guys, so as you can see, right now, the ratio is in 16 ratio 9. And I don't want to create my video in 16 ratio 9. So I have to change the particular ratio of the video to 1 ratio 1, alright? So for you to change the ratio, just go to format where the arrow is showing. So I'll tap on format, then I'll change it to 1 ratio 1 as you can see. So once you change it to 1 ratio 1, you have to extend the particular background you added. So I'll just extend this background to fit in the screen with my tool, alright? So I'll extend this okay so this is so perfect right now so once you do that you can just delete cap cut watermark if you want so i'll tap on the watermark then i'll click on delete so once i delete the watermark the next thing for me to do is to start adding my product image all right so before i add any product image i can just extend this background to at least 20 seconds it depends on the duration of the video you can always trim out the background if you don't want any part of it later all right so i think 20 seconds is okay so once i do that like i said i want to add my first product image so i'll tap on this overlay and i'll click on hard overlay so right here i have the particular product image i want to use so the link to download all these product image are in the description below so make sure you download it and you use them for your own video also all right so the first product image i'll be adding is this so after i tap on it i'll click on this add so once you click on add this is what you are going to see all right so right here i can just decrease the size a little bit with my hand with my two finger then i'll place it down because i don't want every part of it to show all right so once you do this, the next thing for you to do is to click on animation. So right here, you are not adding in or out animation. The only animation you want to add is combo. So I'll tap on this combo. Then the combo animation you want to be using right now is left zoom. All right. Just find left zoom. So let me just find this right here and let me add the animation to it. Okay. So this is it. As you can see, left zoom. All right. So once you click on it, I'll click on this mark icon here to add the animation. So let's see how it works. Alright guys, so once you add this animation, the next thing for me to add is my text. So I'll go to text. Then I'll click on this add text. So right here, the first text I want to add is Coca-Cola. Alright, then I'll just write Coca-Cola. Alright, so once I do that... I'll just change the font of the text to something nice. So let me see the font right here. Okay, so here's the font I use, bangers. So right now, I have to change the color of the text. So I'll tap on this style. So I want the color to be white and it's already in white. So the only thing I will change right here is the stroke. So I'll tap on this stroke. Then I'll change the stroke color to this, where the arrow is showing then you can just increase the stroke thickness or you can leave it like that all right so i'll leave it like that and i will extend the text so i want the text to be here i make sure everything you are doing you are following the line 
the green line that is showing right there all right so once i do this the next thing for me to do is to click on this animation so i want to add animation to my text so the in animation i'll be adding is glitch all right just find glitch right now this is it glitch and i will increase the duration to be 0.7 seconds all right and the out animation i'll be adding is jump and flip so i'll find the animation jump and flip so let's find it right here jump and flip okay all right guys so here's the out animation jump and flip so i'll tap on it then i can just increase it to 0.9 seconds so i'll increase it to 0.9 seconds now so this particular place where the arrow is showing that is a place you can simply increase the duration of the in animation and this particular place where the arrow is showing that is a place you can simply increase the out animation so i'll click on mark so let's play this video and let's see how it looks all right guys so this is so perfect right now as you can see so the next thing for me to do is to input my second product image exactly when the first product image is going out all right so right here where the product image and the text effect is going out i want to add the second product image so i'll click back then i'll go to overlay then i'll click on this add overlay so i will add the second product image right now okay is it then i'll click on this add all right so once i add the second product image i don't want every part of it to show all right so i'll just adjust it to be here okay so this is nice by me okay so once i do that the next thing for me to do is to add animation to it so i'll tap on this animation then the animation i'll be adding is combo all right so right now we are not adding in or out animation we are only adding combo animation so the product image all right so the combo animation i'll be using right here is pendulum one so this is the animation then i'll tap on it then i'll click on mark so once i add the combo animation to the particular product image the next thing for me to do is to add a text so i have to add a text at the point i had the second product image all right so right now i'll click on text then i'll click on this add text so the first text will be refreshing so i'll type refreshing all right so right now i'll click on this animation so the in animation i'll be adding is slingshot okay so we have to find the in animation right here so here's the animation slingshot so i'll tap on it then i will increase the animation to be 1.0 seconds so once i do that i'll click on out animation so the out animation we'll be using is dilute so this is it i'll tap on it then i will also increase the animation to be 0.5 seconds so once i do that i'll click on this mark so right here i have to duplicate this text so i'll tap on the text then i'll click on this copy all right so i'll tap on the second text then i'll click on this pencil icon to edit the text so right here i'll be writing text all right so i'll just bring this text to be right here okay then i'll click on mark so i have to adjust the particular product image so let me just adjust it to be like this all right guys so this is perfect right now as you can see all right this is so perfect all right so let's add the next product image to the video all right so at the particular point this particular product image is going out i want to add a new product image all right so i'll click on this add overlay so i'll tap on this product image then i'll click on this add so right here i'll just decrease the size of this then i'll place it right here okay all right so once i do this i'll tap on it again then i'll go to animation so the animation we are going to be adding to this particular product image is combo so you are not adding in animation or out animation so i'll tap on combo 
so the combo animation is zoom to all right just find zoom to okay this is it click on this mark all right so at the particular point i had the third product image i will also add the text okay so i'll tap on this particular text then i'll click on add text so the text i want to add is 100 percent no alcohol so the first thing i'll write is 100 percent 100 percent none so this is the first text i want to write all right then i'll go to animation so the in animation i'll be using is is in right all right just find the in animation is in right this is it and make sure you increase the duration to 1.0 seconds then i'll go to the out animation so the out animation i'll be adding is is out right all right here is it is out right so i will also increase the seconds to the 0.9 seconds all right let me just adjust this text let me place it right here okay so i'll click on mark then i'll click on this copy where the arrow is showing to duplicate the text so i'll copy it then i'll change it to a call all right then i will just make sure everything fits in okay let me just decrease the size of the accord all right guys so this will perfect right now so let's see let's see this all right guys so at the particular place where the third product image and the text is going out I want to add the next product image. All right. So at this particular place right now, I want to add my third product image. Okay. So I'll tap on this overlay. That's add overlay. Then the product image I want to add right here is this particular one. Then I'll click on this add. So this particular product image I added, I'll tap on it, then I want it to be here. So I'll just rotate it with my hand, be like this, right? Then I want it to be like this. Okay, so this is okay by me. So I'll tap on the product image again, then I'll go to animation. Then I'll click on this combo. So the combo animation we want to add to this particular product image is right zoom, all right? just find it right zoom so let me just find it right here so here's the combo animation right then i'll click on mark so at the particular point i added the fourth product image i'll also add my text okay so i'll click on text then i'll click on add text so the text i want to add is low sugar content all right so the first thing I'll write is low sugar. Once I type the low sugar, then I'll click on this animation to add the animation to it. All right. So the in animation we'll be using is wave in. So I'll just find for wave in right here. Wave in. All right. So here is it. Wave in. Then the duration will be 1.1 seconds. All right, then the out animation will be grow. So let's find for grow. So here's the grow animation. That is the out animation. Then the duration will be 0 0.7 seconds. All right, then I'll click on this mark. So right here, I have to duplicate this text and I also have to decrease the size and place this right here. Then I'll click on this copy. Then I'll edit it to be content, all right? that's low sugar content so this one will be content then i will adjust it to be here all right guys so let's see this all right guys as you can see the cool animation as this particular one is going out this one just coming like that and it is very very cool all right so right now we have to add the last product image okay so at this particular point right here i want to add the last 
product image so i'll go to my overlay then i'll click on hard overlay so right now i want to add 3d product image okay so i will add this first then i'll click on hard then i'll decrease the size and i'll place it right here then i'll click on hard overlay again then i will add this i'll click on hard then i'll decrease the size and make sure everything fits all right then i'll click on this add overlay again to add the last one so i will add this then i'll click on hard then i will also decrease the size so once i do this i can just adjust each one of them okay so this one right here i want it to be here then the second one i will also adjust it then this last one also i adjust it to be here guys so once you do this the next thing for you to do is to add animation to every one of them all right so i'll go to overlay then this particular one right here i'll tap on it then i'll click on this animation then i'll click on in animation so right here we are not adding combo animation to the product image the animation we want to add is just in animation all right so the in animation we'll be adding is shake 2 so i'll find for shake 2 this is it all right then i will increase it to be the 3.0 seconds click on mark so the second product image i added also i'll click on anim animation shake 2 all right all right so i'll click on mark and the last one also i'll click on it then i'll click on animation then i'll click on in animation then i'll tap on shake 2 then i'll click on this mark so the next thing for me to add is the text so i'll tap on text then i'll click on this add text so the text i want to write right now is drink coca-cola all right so the first thing i'll write is drink so right here i will just type drink then i'll click on this animation so i'll add in animation to it that is zoom out so i'll find for zoom out this is it all right then i'll click on this mark then this particular text i will duplicate it i'll click on this copy then i'll change the text to be coca-cola all right all right guys so once i type this i'll click on mark then i will adjust the text so right now this to be here then this particular drink i'll just decrease the size and place it to be here all right all right guys so this is so perfect right now then you can just trim out the particular place you don't want so from here i'll trim out everything so i'll tap on it i'll click on splint then this particular text i'll click on splint then i'll delete them delete and delete then this particular white background i also click on splint then i'll delete it so i will also go to this overlay okay this okay so let's play this video from the beginning and let's see how it looks so let me play it Alright guys, so as you can see, that is so perfect. So you can just click on this particular audio to add any music of your choice. Okay, so if you want to save your video, just tap here where the arrow is showing. So I'll tap on it. Right now, my video is now saving. Alright, so if you love this video, don't forget to like. So more people will need to discover this video. And if you want to receive more video like this, make sure you subscribe and turn on the notification so you'll be notified anytime i drop a new video like this thank you for watching i'll see you in my next video tutorial